Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing a fresh case, half case break of 2017 Tops Museum Collection Baseball. Uh, it's a pick your team break number 15 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. The other half of the case is already in the store, so let's do that one tonight as well. So let's flip to the screen right here. Fresh case on a Thursday. Where's, how am I setting my focus here? Is it going to be right here? Yeah, right about there is good. All right, so number 15, Jeremy Merle with that last spot mojo. He bought the last couple teams, actually. White Sox were officially his last spot mojo. Good luck to him, and good luck to everybody else. Here we go. Fresh case, so let's pop this baby open. See which half we're gonna do. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's six. We're gonna be doing the right side. So this left side will be reserved for break number 16, sweet 16. So one, I'll kind of hard to write like this, this angle. All right, so you should be able to see on the camera right there, 16's right there. There it is, so you'll know that's for the next break. Set that right there, and here are the boxes that we're going to do right here. All right, good luck, everybody. Museum collection, always a fan favorite here at Jaspie's Hobbyland. We'll go through all the base cards first, and then we'll go through the hits per usual. Obviously, it's a fresh case, so all the case hits are still up for grabs. Everything ships in this. Conquering Lion, everything ships in this. Uh oh, oh, that card's hidden on the other side, that stack. I didn't even realize that. Let's see if I could slide this over this way. That's pretty good. All right, we'll do these numbered cards first. There's Goodiel, 350 out of, nope, that's 50 out of 150. For the Astros, that goes to Cameron. Roger Maris, 19 out of 50. For the Bronx Bombers, that'll go to Dano. And we'll start over here. Sale Tulo Scherzer. Oh, actually, you know what? How, this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to go through all these first. It's been a minute or two since I've done since we've done museum collection, so throwing off a little bit. Braun and Ass and Russell. All right. There's Syndergaard canvas and nice Xander Bogarts quad relic three out of 50 nice primary pieces 
for the Red Sox. That'll go to Karen Steele. I like the uh, World Baseball Classic patches. I think they look pretty cool. All right, on this side behind you, Lee, is Corey Seager. There you go. Bat and relic, 25 out of 99. Dual relic and autograph. Corey Seager for Lee Keller and the Dodgers. Little Dodger Joe Mojo. First box on the board. You can stress less throughout this break. You're welcome, Lee. Hopefully this is this will get you back on track. Nice piece of his lumber, too. Nice Corey Seager. Behind the Cespedes is Salvador Perez. 5 out of 50, meaningful material. See, there you go, folks. That's a good example of, of Lee getting back in, trying time and time again. And then being rewarded. And there's Salvador Perez for the Royals. That will go to Jeremy Merle. And the last autograph here is a Jake Thompson. 008 out of 299 for the Philadelphia Phillies. I'll go to Jason K. That's right. Don't never give up, Lee. Never give up. That's what you do. You got you got to get your at bats in. You know what you know what I mean, ladies and gentlemen. Get your abs in, and they can get some hits. So I need a different size top loader on this. He's going to he's different size. Lee's just like, hey, let's keep the hits coming. Because it has been a little, yeah. Well, hopefully this will be a multi-hit game for Lee. And for everybody. I want, I want multi-hit games for everybody. I want everyone to go for like, have like a four for five day. That boosts the average up pretty nicely. All right, so that was box one. We got a Corey Seager out of there, which is pretty solid. Let's see what else we can get. Good luck, folks. And Conquering Lion needs, uh, well, could be one of those days. Dodger Joe Mojo and maybe some Oppo Joe Mojo as well. Jason has the, uh, Conquering Lion has the Giants. All right, start off with Will Myers, 37 out of 99 for the Friars. Myers for the Friars, that goes to Conquering Lion. Jason's to do with that. Oh. Plastic on that top loader, it's not very good. There you go, that's a good one. Cargo, 143 out of 150. That goes to the rocks. That'll be for Lee. And the hits coming up soon once I go through all these.
All right, your canvas collection is Kenta Maeda. Nice reproduction there. And a Cub, 98 out of 99, Anthony Rizzo. Leadoff hitter, Anthony Rizzo, for Casey and the Cubs. Behind Dansby is a Dustin. 10 out of 50, Dustin Pedroia, meaningful material for Karen. And the Bo Sox. Laser show. Behind Eric Hosmer is a Chris Bryant. 29 out of 50, archival autographs, Chris Bryant for Casey Lawson and the Cubs. Casey's been on a, I feel like in the last few nights of breaking with us, has been on a decent upswing. So nice Chris Bryant. Yeah, Corey Seager and in the first box, Chris Bryant in the second box, not too shabby. And behind Ted Williams is, put a bird on it, Greg Bird, triple relic and autograph, 16 out of 25 for Dano and the Yanks. All right, two boxes in, four boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. So this is museum, this is the first half of the case, museum collection number 15, pick your team 15. The second half is in the store right now. I feel like we should do both tonight. I think that would be I think that would be cool. I love this museum collection. There's always always cool things to see in here. Tice, what's going on? You received your jersey in like two days. That's that's way too fast. We we can't set the bar that high. No, I'm glad I'm glad you got it, Tice. Right. 82 out of 150, Giancarlo Stanton. Oh, that's true. You're on the West Guy. Yeah, that's, that's true. Might be a little bit faster then. Uh, oh, there's no other numbered cards there. Cargo, Bryce, Ted, Boppy, and Posey. McGuire, Miggy, and Chris. Gary, Freddie, and Carlos. All right. Right here is a reproduction of Corey Seager. We've only seen one that was an actual an actual one-of-one uh, one piece of art. Maybe we could find some more. Right here is Jason Hamill. 41 out of 50, meaningful material. Uh, that's another cub for Casey. Nice. That must come from the, the, the ring, the C around there, or maybe a number. It's pretty cool. Does you Darvish get, does he get traded by the deadline? I don't know. We'll see. Nice. That's a case hit. Wilson Contreras. Two out of 15 momentous material. Great patch. Nice auto for Casey and the Chicago Cubs. Cubs doing nicely in this one. Behind Giancarlo is Paul Canerco. 89 out of 99 archival autographs for the White Sox. That's last spot mojo for Jeremy Merle. Last spot mojo, 80% of the time. It hits 100% of the time. It's a fact, a mathematical fact. Check it out. It's true. Roger Maris reveals some Marlins. 
Nice. Giancarlo Stan, D. Gordon, Christian Yelich, and Marcelo Zuna. Great patches in there. Marlins, 79 out of 99. Jeremy Merle with the Miami Marlins. Merle with the Miami Marlins. I like that alliteration there. Nice. Looks good. Nice primary pieces. All right. Next box. About ha We're only about halfway there, to be honest with you. So, still a lot of hits to go. That feels like the frame, feels a little heavy. Could be psyching myself out, but. And like I said, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Let's get the uh, second half done tonight as well. Even if we get that frame, there's still plenty of big hits to be found. Oh, there it is. There's the frame. Any guesses on the frames? Or any wishes? All right, there's Roger Maris out of 150. I didn't see any. Oh, no, there was a Philly, wasn't there, earlier? You guys, uh, wasn't there like a rookie Philly in here somewhere? Oh, it was Jake Thompson. That's what it was. Thanks, Lee. Yeah, it was a Jake Thompson autograph, Jason K. That's what you got. Um, so Casey, Chris Beck saying, don't be a Randy or Schilling. Casey says Griffey. Gabe says Griffey. Lee says any Dodger or Ro Rocky player. All right, all right. We'll do the frame last in this box. All right, we're going to start off with Yaz revealing a Xander Bogarts. 77 out of 99 quad relic for Karen and the Red Sox. Rick says Nolan Ryan. Nolan Ryan would be cool. Oh, no worries, Jason. Behind the Hank Aaron canvas reproduction is Ian Kinsler, two out of 50, two color patch, meaningful material. Tigers, Jeffrey Mason. Jason R says Cal. Casey says Trout. Trout would be pretty cool. Behind Strasburg is an Aaron Nola. Just in time, Jason K. 42 out of 50, dual relic and Aaron Noah's always nice autograph. Yeah, Aaron Nola follows directions really well. Look at this. Nice spacing between the left and the right. Well centered, top and bottom. He always has a nice autograph. Nice Aaron Nola and the frame. My case is probably be another Cub. Well, here's Masahiro Tanaka. Wow. It's the big hurt. Two out of ten gold ink, gold frame autograph of the big hurt. Last spot mojo, Jeremy Merle. That is nice. White Sox were just sitting there, too. They're sitting there for the taking. Nice big hurt. All right, that's a big hit. Two boxes to go. Remember, second half in the store, jazbeeshobbyland.com. And just because the frame came out doesn't, I mean, this has been a nice case. So I'm thinking that the rest of the case will probably also be nice.
jazbeeshobbyland.com. Pick your team. Let's get it done tonight. And I think we have one more museum after that. So once we do the second half, I can post another case. And believe it or not, this may just be an honest mistake by an honest mistake by Tops, but I've seen cases with uh, I've seen cases with two frames in there. It's a possibility, not common, but. All right, there's Yohan Mankata for Jeremy. 44 out of 50 on that one, White Sox edition. I believe there's some, I believe there's some Mankata's, um, still has Red Sox edition, right? Or maybe I'm confusing that with tier one. Wait, was there, okay, because I think Chris Beck was saying something earlier about the 12 one of one case. There's been two now, because I know of the one. So is there a second? Well, how, come we, how come we don't get those cases? Let's play two in Alex Reyes. Griffey, Javier, and Daniel. Francisco, Kyle, and Roberto. Thor, Jeter, and Xander. Reproduction for the Marlins and archival autographs, Jacob deGrom, 92 out of 99 for the Joe Ivers and the Metropolitans. There you go, we got Joe on the board. There's the big hurt, just pulled his frame and there's Rick Porcello for Karen. Out of 299, nice. Behind Mike Piazza is a Corey Kluber. Wow, that's a nice patch. 28 out of 35. You got some of that digital camo look that they put on their uniforms. You got stitching. You got red. You got white. Nice. For the tribe, that goes to Bruce Will. Getting Bruce on the board. Nice looking patch. All right, and behind the professor, Greg Maddox is an Anthony Rizzo. 47 out of 75, two color quad relic, Casey and the Cubbies. And the last box, folks. Good luck, everyone. Good luck. Like I said, folks, jazbeeshobbyland.com for all of your baseball, football, basketball needs and other stuff. Got other stuff on there too. Second half of the case is right up here. So if you want to do that, we should do it tonight. jazbeeshobbyland.com. Would love to. It'd be a lot of fun. Love the museum collection. A lot of big hits in here. A lot of fun times. Start with the numbered serial numbered base cards, 132 out of 150. You Darvish, Rangers for Sam. 
Are the Rangers buyers or sellers in the uh, trade window? Chris Sale, 43 out of 99 for Karen and the Red Sox. Red Sox having a nice break. These top loaders, not nice. Must have not used the right plastic formula at the factory. <laughs> this one's good. All right, here we go. Last bits here, Buster, Alex, and Jackie. We got Tulo and Max. Lou and Corey. David Ortiz, McCutcheon, and Brett. And wow, look at this. Ken Griffey Jr., our artist original canvas collection. I thought it looked a little different. Here, I'll, I'll get you a nice close-up on this. Who has the Mariners? Jeff Dorlack with the Mariners. Now you can actually see the, the artwork right here. That is awesome. Yeah, Dano said, I feel bad. Dano got the, the Mariners in the second half of the case, but he said before the break, he's saying nice hit, though. He's congratulating you, Jeff. He was saying before we even opened up this case, he was like, I feel like there's going to be some big hit for the Mariners. And there it is. Is this a well-known Topps artist as well as Chris Beck? Nice. And these are one of a kind. So, Jeff, Slam Jam, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -hoo! What a, This has been a strong case. And primary pieces, 57 out of 7. There he is, Jeff. Congrats, man. Nice Trevor Story for uh, Lee and the Rockies. That's a reproduction. On this side right here, we have Brandon Nemo, 6 out of 10. That's a uh, Mets, right? Pretty sure it is. Yeah, he is a New York Met. And that is for Joe Ivers. Behind Chipper Jones is an A.J. Reed for the Astros. Dual relic and autograph, 216 out of 299. Stroh's going to Cameron. I think believe there should be one more autograph behind that Mookie Betts. And so behind that Mookie Betts is... A Kyle Schorber, 27 out of 90. So you got the Chris Bryant archival autograph, Casey. And now you have the Kyle Schorber archival autograph, 27 out of 99. Nice break for the Cubs. Nice break overall. Seen a lot of cool stuff. That Frank Thomas gold frame. That Ken Griffey Jr. original sketch work. Nice stuff. JaspiesHobbyland.com. This was Pick Your Team 15. Second half of the case in the store. I have a feeling this is going to be a hot case. I'm feeling that's going to be hot. So let's keep the heat going on jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is Joe. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.